so student today we are going to start a new chapter playing with number here the topic is generalized form of numbers so here the generalized form of number means it's a general form general form of any number two digit number okay so here if we'll take a like two digit number first we'll go for the two digit number okay and we'll try to make the general form of two digit number like if we'll take 28 I think that you know that how to expand this number like 20 plus 8 yes if we'll take uh, 92 this can be written as 90 plus 2 yes if we'll take uh, 67 this can be written as 60 plus 7 and now if we'll go for this one again you can see that 10 into 2 plus 8 and this can be written as 10 into 9 plus 2 and this can be written as 10 into 6 plus 7 have you seen in each number two digit number this 10 is common and look at this is your ones place digit and this is your tens place digit so if we we'll make this number in this form you can see that ones place digit is here this is your ones place digit okay and this one is your tens place digit yes in each case you can see that ones place digit is here tens place digit is here that means if i'll take two digit number this is your general form now we're going to write x y bar okay don't get confused sir why you are writing x y bar this is the presentation of two digit number and to present this number in this form we need to write see here this is your tens place digit that means if we we'll go for this expression that means you will get here 10 X plus Y if I'll take reverse of this number like 28 reverse number is what 28 reverse number is 82 now if you we'll see this one that is your 10 into 2 plus 8 and if you we'll see this one that is your 10 into 8 plus 2 that means if we'll take y x bar this can be written as 10 y plus x this is the reverse number okay of this one and this is the presentation of two digit number now if we we'll go for three digit number okay so this can be present as if we'll take 375 this can be written as 300 plus 70 plus 5 this can be written as 100 into 3 plus 10 into 7 plus 5 that means if i'll take this general form of the three digit number that is x y z and there should be a bar that can be written as what 100 x plus 10 y plus j if you we'll go four digit number x y z and you take any other number okay uh, or, or instead of taking this one we take a b c d this will be better than this one okay so this can be written thousand a plus hundred b plus ten c plus d so you can see that this is the channel from Okay. Now question will arise, sir. If I'll if I'll take x y like this, then what will happen? No matter, we cannot take. Why? See, for x equals to one or take four, and y equals to five. If I'll ask you find find x y, y x, x y bar and y x bar. If I'll ask you to find. Okay. So in this case, you can see the for the first one that you need x y means x into y that is 20 and if you see y into x that is 5 into 4 you will get 20 but if you we'll see x y bar means the number should be remain same that is 4 5 that is 45 and if we go for y x bar that will be 54 see the difference this is the difference i hope you have understood generalized form of numbers thank you